Okay, I want to do a video about just the box itself for issue four of the quarterly concern. I've got a first printing box here uh, inscribed in sign. The first printing box is incredibly fragile. The attrition rate has to be sky high. It takes nothing at all to destroy a first printing box. The second printing box is very nice. Uh, <laughs> the first one is just pitiful. Uh, they probably had to do the second printing box because the first one was so bad. Uh, I won't go too far down that road. But this box, when you see them, they tend to be dirty, tend to be soiled. The box has just a very slight gloss to it. Uh, but it really doesn't resist soiling very well. It gets dirty pretty easily. And they can look white to people, but not really be white if you put it next to <laughs> a correct box. It doesn't look white anymore. This one is a this one is white. This is correct. The damage on these and the webcam is just lighting up the white on this. I'm sorry about that. Um, I will link to a couple of pictures in the description. These boxes, the top edge is usually the first thing to go, and it's usually where the most damage is. Any kind of weight on this on this front panel will just collapse it, just pancake it get horizontal creasing all the way across and then the paper will split and then it will just plain crease. This one has just a touch of horizontal bend to it. I can see where it's got just a touch of bend in the horizontal marks. This is pretty nice. I've got just a bit of bend at the diagonal here. These side panels typically come out very well. They don't get crushed too much. The center of the box does get crushed. The center of the box gets crushed instead of just a little bend here. You get a nasty crease on the diagonal it'll start and they'll go all the way down diagonal all the way across horizontally because the chat books don't fill the box up. And any weight on the top of the box will bend it, crease it. It's not pretty. The front panel here, similar to this top panel, it will start to bend, then it will start to crease, and it will just pancake. The top panel is always the worst. The bottom panel is usually not as bad, but that's the next place to look. The bottom is usually great. There's hardly ever anything wrong with the bottom. The lid, this has a tabbed lid. The second printing box does not have the tab. This has a tabbed lid. And when I store this box, I do not use the slot. I don't want to be putting the tab in the slot and taking it out. I don't want to use the tab and slot. I just fold the tab back a little in front of the slot and push it down. I also put some tissue in in the top to help further protect the top of the box from caving in the second anything touches it. The tab, pretty often the tab will delaminate, the plies will come apart, which can usually be conserved if it hasn't been torn. So if you've got a tab that's delaminating, it hasn't been torn, that can, that can probably be fixed. Uh, the inside of the box, there's never anything wrong with the inside of the box. So those are the things to look for on condition and the things that can happen and some of the things you can do to defend against that. Uh, this panel will bend, then it will crease, then it will pancake. Watch out for the tab. Plies start coming apart. This top panel, this is the first place to look. Is it creased? Is it bent? Is it creased? Is it pancaked? Has the paper split? 
that cracked all the way across and is the white white and if you're buying it from somebody do they know what a correct box looks like do they know what white looks like they've got one and you've never seen another one they may not know what white looks like um, that's a problem and if you take pictures and send you pictures color not necessarily going to be correct you can look bright white and you get it and it's dirty very hard to buy these boxes uh, especially from people who know that it's not quite they'll give you pictures that aren't all that honest um, this box is routinely overgraded by a lot um, so I'm lucky this is a very nice one we safely got this out of the UK this box came out of the UK it is to Rosie the exclamation point you saw you do these good things the little arrow to the birdie Signed D. Eggers, contemporary to publication. Just a great inscribed sign box. I think that's all I want to uh, put in this video. I will link to some pictures, uh, probably of good boxes and bad boxes. It doesn't show well. It's so white, which is nice. It's so white. The webcam is just blowing it up. It's not as white. It's not as white as the webcam is showing it. And that's it for now.